Hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. We are starting our ranch let's play. Uh, let me pause it for a second. I, uh, no, you didn't see me create these two beautiful Sams. Well, you did see me create her. I created her a while back, uh, like several months ago. I just went in and edited her and then created a, uh, partner for her but yeah we have our lovely ranch ish <laughs> we have nothing planted we have no animals uh we broke i took away all their money so this is going to be um fun i'm debating on whether or not to turn the dust back on what do you think should i turn dust back on if i do then i'll need to get her a broom because we're not doing the vacuum cleaners, but, um, I'll need to get a broom. And I'm also debating, should I turn on simple living? Should I turn on, um, oh, good Lord, off the grid and reduce and recycle to make it a little more challenging. Um, just curious what lot challenges you would like to see me put on there that I don't already have. I've, I have, um, right now all I have is wild foxes and wild prairie grass. But if you want me to put on something else, I can. If you want me to add two, I can do that. Whatever you would like me to do. Uh, so we can really test and play through this pack. But I gave him or gave her the aspiration of expert nectar maker. So that is something she's going to be working toward. And I gave him the championship rider. So he will be working toward that. So first thing for him, we've got to get a horse. Um, but we're going to have to earn some money first. So I think... Because we want to fix this place up. I want to make it more of a modern ranch slash farmhouse style. I want to make it all pretty. But I still want to keep it kind of rustic. Um, so we're going to have to earn money for that. And it's going to take some time. This is definitely not going to go as fast as the Inherited Manor went for me. Even though I'm not done with that. I am taking a little bit of a break. Um, but yeah. So I think, oh, this guy's pretty. There's some stars. Uh, I think we go find some jobs to do. Um, so yeah, let's let's go do that. I don't think she belongs here. Juniper Grove. Let's go introduce ourselves. I need to get rid of that routine. I never use it. Friendly. Let's do a howdy introduction. And you can do the same. Let's see. Is there anything that we can harvest that we might be able to plant? After you introduce yourself, why don't you come look for frogs? We can get some frogs and sell that. Or breed them if we can find another one. If not, we'll just sell it. Be a little bit of money so that they can eat i have never explored this world i have not played in this world yet i have just been i just built on the lot that was all i did um what do we find oh we can sell that um, and he found an alabaster. 30. That might get us enough to buy some seeds or something. Maybe. Could always make him go fishing. 
we've got to earn enough to we need to plant the garden so that we have some food but we also need to get a horse we also want to plant the garden so that we can make nectar once we can start harvesting I want a squirrel that is cute they're a loud cat that we're going to avoid now I know the board is here somewhere let's see I don't know if there's any jobs that we can do since we don't have a horse but we're gonna see there it is all right let's see community jobs right neighbor's horse we have zero horse riding skill um, but we can go try it and see since that's his thing He wants to be the championship rider. And I'm not seeing anything else that we can get. Well, good for him. Maybe he'll do okay. I mean, minimum, we get 95 bucks. So I'll take that. How much is it to um, adopt a horse? I know those can be a little more difficult to work with, but we're all about the rescue. Learn about residents, plan a ranch event, buy mini goats and mini sheep. Okay, a mini goat is 150, which we don't have. Why is the black sheep so much more? I mean, I'm the black sheep of the family, so. I get it. We're prosperous, but. Um, and how much is it to adopt a horse? I really tried to make this look as rustic as possible without using CC. Now, from what I understand, you can find things in the prairie grass. If we find something that's worth quite a bit, we will use it to go ahead and get a horse so that he can get started on his aspiration. Okay. As I was saying, I uh, tried to make it look as rustic as possible without using CC. I did some debug stuff. There was more that I wanted to put in here, but the way my game has been lagging lately, I was afraid to put too much. Hopefully I can get a a better computer. I want to get a desktop. What did I find? What is that? A coconut. Well... I don't think um, coconuts would be native <laughs> to this area, so I'm not going to plant that. And it's not worth even selling, selling it, so I will just put it in the fridge when I remember where the fridge is at. And while I could probably make, I, mean, I could make some decent money off that, I also know if we are able to get a horse, then we will need to uh, be able to feed them. How much did he get? 95. Yeah, that's what I figured. We can go ahead, let's see. Purchase seeds. No, we want some starter fruits and starter vegetables and maybe some herbs uh, Jason's newfound horse riding skill will grow as he rides horses with high levels of horse riding skill sims gain powerful moodlets from riding are more likely to win competitions at the equestrian center 
and are less prone to getting bucked off their horse. She made a discovery while searching for her. She found a mushroom. Okay. Let's open these packets. Oh, and she found a bell pepper. And apparently manure. Let's get her stuff started. I do want an orchard, but I don't want banana. I won't mainly um, have y'all both come and plant. I want to have um, me, you here. Like apples and stuff like that like you would see like if you'd went to like the northern states and did apple picking you do in the fall and that sort of thing what is the manure okay and i will have her um Okay, why are y'all not continuing? You can probably hear my daughter getting onto the cat right now. Now we're broke, so let's go ahead and sell the avocado. And we have one mushroom, so we'll plant it there. I was going to get you to water some stuff, but... Alrighty. Please don't set the house on fire. Because grilled cheese does that. Please don't set the house on fire. Please don't burn the house down. We cannot afford a fire right now. We're going to take the water part off. Let him go use the restroom. And then he can get him a... How many did she serve? Just one or just two or how many? Oh, family size. Let him grab a serving of it. You go to the restroom. And then I want to have you come out here and water. Since you are the one that wants to make nectar. The garden is technically yours. Is there any prairie grass? Yeah, there is. And I'm going to have you harvest all this as well. Well, we can sell these. It's only nine bucks. So it's not much, but it's a little bit. Keep them from being completely broke. And we need to buy our lights all lot. That way, maybe it'll help with the power bill. Are you done? Nope. Oh, you're leveled up. Can you fertilize now? No. Gotta be level three. Well. Your energy's great, so why don't we... You can't research. Oh, it's because they're out of season. Well, we can research sage. And the green peas. Yeah, you can go out here and talk to her while she works. But I guess I should completely introduce them. This is Shania and Jace Thunderhawk. Uh, they are married. They are indigenous, if you couldn't tell. Because a while back when I created her, I had made the statement that there is not enough representation for indigenous peoples and people of color. And as an indigenous person myself, while yes, I do pass as white and do have quite a bit of white, I also have quite a bit of native. My great 
grandmother on my mom's side was um, full Cherokee. And my great-great-grandmother on my dad's side was full Cherokee. Um, so, yeah, I do have quite a bit of Native American heritage. What are you doing? Please don't be trolling the forum. Oh, you're chatting. You can come and chat with her. Let's see what we learned about sage. Tall lavender flowers crane gently in the breeze. Used for food. Graft with basil to get parsley. Good to know. He wants to catch a fish. We can do that. And he wants to go for a jog, which we can do that as well. Just not at midnight. So let's get them assigned to a bed. This is supposed to be... Now, I built this home from a house plan. Like an old house plan. Uh, I did have to take some leeway with it, but uh, let's assign the bed to them too. And then let's go sleep. All right. Oh, she's still very focused. All right. You need to serve some breakfast. Uh, let's just do Two servings of that. I'll have him come out here and harvest all prairie grass. Looks like there's only one that grew overnight. Yeah, that one's not ready either. I definitely don't want to uproot the plant. Oh, looks like it's still growing. Because there was just one. Now all three of those are ready. Oh, yep. It's still growing. Oh, he found outstanding quality horse manure. I will have that moved over into her inventory. And I will have this moved over into his. For now, anyway. He found a frog. Oh, we'll sell the frog. That's a hundred soliads. Yay! We almost have enough for a goat. <laughs> Trash nectar. That just sounds nasty. Uh, did I get... I don't remember if I did or not. I think I did. I got one small one. I do want to build a cellar and put a... Put the... A bunch of these down there. Make it look like an actual um, winery. Oh, he found a grape one, too. It's worth 110. We're going to age them. I think you do that in here. Um, yeah, you have to age them. He found a pineapple. We'll sell the pineapple. I don't feel like they would plant pineapple here. What are you doing, sweet girl? Why don't you come and fertilize? You found a pear. Now, I can see pears, so I am going to plant this one. Come on. Pears and apples, things that you would typically see. Um, I don't know that it'll stay right there, but that's where we're going to put it for now. 
Maybe we can get Patchy to help with the garden. I want to examine him. He found a string. All right. We'll put that in the thing just a minute. Don't you water all? When you get done examining the scarecrow, we have 61. That would get us enough to get some baby goats. All right, let's. We refill the feeder. And then I'm going to have her. I'm going to have her um, order. Y'all are all about the woohoo. Uh, buy mini goats and sheep. Let's see what we can get. Why don't you come when you get done purchasing that? You can chat with the scarecrow. Make small talk. Let's do the brown mini goat. We're going to place in the world. We have a goat. Yay. Yeah, I did not put a lot of lighting in this house. One, I want it to be cozy, but it's also supposed to be run down, so there should not be a whole lot of bright lights in it. Did you eat breakfast? Yes, you did. And then you can put that away. Oh. Let's uh, name him. He needs a better, or she need, he or she needs a better name than kid. Um, I don't remember, I had goats growing up, but I don't remember what we named them. We had one that thought he was a dog, and he used to go to the neighbor's house. <laughs> he ran free because he thought he was a dog. And he'd go to the neighbor's house. He did not like her, and he would headbutt her door, and you'd see her screaming. We'd be out there just laughing. She'd be at the door screaming, telling us, come get that goat, and she'd have the broom trying to shoot away. <laughs> oh, me. Uh, let's, um, let's name it Hopper, because, I mean, while... Not a bunny. They do hop, though. And let's, uh, we can milk for simoleons. And let's bottle feed hopper and clean hopper, even though I doubt hopper is dirty. Oh my gosh, that is flipping it. so tiny. And you're milking this little teeny tiny goat. Oh. There's literally nothing there for you to be milking. Probably milk it and then give them its own milk. Self-sufficient. So cute. She is a rancher at heart. Her idea of a good time includes doing chores around her ranch and interacting with livestock. Rancher Sims excel at ranch life, occasionally making it a bonus bottle when crafting nectar or extra hay when harvesting prairie grass. She will be more successful at horse breeding. We're going to purchase a chicken. Let's get um, let's get a brown hen and come um, and chit chat 
with your wife. Oh, you're doing that anyway. I need to take you fishing since you want to fish, but I don't think there's any place around here where you can fish. Hello, peoples. There's another frog. And there's where we can go fishing. So I will have him make his way there. Oh, and she's not filling. Why is she tense for? Why is she tense? There's no reason for her to be tense. All right. You go clean that up or whatever it is you're doing. You just gonna stay out here by yourself, baby? Uh, you can get them to help with gardening? Okay. Mm. Talk about kid days. Talk about mineral cravings. Too bad you can't play with them. I mean, you can pet them and stuff, but I wish you could play. Socialize. Pet. Can you play? Oh, you can. Anamaloo is the yacht? Oh. Uh -huh. Aww. Oh. They're so cute. I miss the goats we had growing up. Alright, why don't you chat with Scarecrow? Um, question about his ability to actually scare the crows. It's kind of mean. Uh, tell harvest jokes. Zarf Samzo, quink, quink, Abba. <laughs> Discuss birds. Oh, go just care. I missed it. Oh my lord, the scarecrow scared the goat. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh goodness. That was funny. Come on, I just need you to catch one fish. Because it's on your list to do. Uh, let's open it because we usually get two. I do think I'm going to go ahead and leave this episode right here. Uh, on the note of the um, goat getting scared crapless. And I am going to um, start getting Cheyenne ready for her appointments. If you did enjoy this episode, please like, share, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to ring that little bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. Uh, I do want your input, so don't forget to comment down below your thoughts on everything I asked at the beginning. And wherever you are in the world, I hope you're having a wonderful day, morning, evening, night. And I'll see you beautiful people next time. Bye, y'all.